patients in this pharmaceutical care hypertension. So, Allen's strategy, Allen's has been taking place before the study uh, has started. Next, please. In order to change the perception of the role of the pharmacy, we decided that many efforts had to be done. And so national policy drugs were organized during 2000, two, sorry, 2006 and 2007, which were organized by the National Technical Group. And they gathered all the stakeholders of the country to discuss important policy details. Next, please. We have the participation of the main authority, the Ministry of Health, of the Ministry itself, of the representative of PAHO in our country, of the deans of the Faculty of Pharmacy and Medicines Faculty as well, in order to arrive to final conclusions during this policy drugs meeting. At the end of this meeting, next please, the outcomes, the main outcomes of both meetings were the awareness of GPP project by pharmacy. It says that national authorities and all the stakeholders, but we detect three points that have to be developed. The need to improve pharmacy's training to give services centered in the patient the need to improve pharmacy's role on health promotion activity, the need to change a broad range of situations to implement GBP, but one of the main outcomes in particular would be that pharmacy were detected for the rest of the players that we can be good and relevant partners in healthcare team. We have also been working on Chinese legislative framework and uh, the legislative task force that has been working during two years because our legislation is very old, it's from the 80s, well as in Thai. And they have finally and luckily arrived to the first draft document that has been approved by the Drug Medicines Department by the Division of Health Product as well, and now is in consideration of the Ministry of Health by Herself. And so, in this change, one of the most important things is that community pharmacy is recognized as a health center as well as a commercial setting. The pharmaceutical care concept is being introduced in this new proposal, pharmacy assistance training requirements are being established and community services are being recognized. In order to raise public awareness toward the added value of the pharmacy role, we have decided to organize two kinds of activity. You know that in community pharmacy in our country for many years the situation was quite quiet and it has been organized a lot of activities recently. So we called pharmacies initiative on April of this year during the second the third national meeting of community pharmacy. We call them to present individual projects of each pharmacy and we have suggested that this proposal should be sent with a systemic approach adapted to each pharmacy. After this, which has been done on April of this year, we have required all the pharmacists to be presented a summary of the advance that has been done in the six months. This initiative has been done through the National Technical Group, but the Ministry of Health has taken off the advertisement and the register of the pharmacy who 
voluntarily would like to participate of this kind of activity. Um, 50 pharmacy has been registered in the Ministry of Health to do this kind of thing. The best examples were selected to be presented on the fourth national meeting of community pharmacies, which was held during the 9th November of this year. So, Ophelia Nosetti may be one tip, another people remember her from good. Was one of the experience she carried out a whole campaign in order to promote health services within the community pharmacy and the following diapo that you are going to appreciate is part of this campaign, please. It's in Spanish, this is blood pressure, which are risk factors, risk cardiovascular factors. Next, please. Cholesterol, in the same group. The next, please. Diabetes, risk cardiovascular factor. Obesity, next, please. A smoking cessation. Stress. This group has been because in our country with the main prevalence, the main disease are cardiovascular and cancer disease and with the prevalence of uh, the main cause of death. This is flu. Next, please. This is slices. Next. Um, luckily, it has not arrived to Uruguay, but it is in the region in Argentina, Brazil, and Paraguay. This is a mosquito that uh, transmit an illness that is called dengue. Next, please. And anticonceptions for to use it. Next, please. A second project that is in Spanish good pharmacy practice that was well considered was the project that was proposed by two different pharmacies that has worked in association. These are the responsible from each pharmacy. And both pharmacies are from neighborhood which live in critical zones. What is this? We call this part of the society. We have 3.6 percentage of our whole population. We live in critical poverty. And this neighborhood, this pharmacy, where works in this area. Next, please. All these are the neighborhood of these 4% of the population. And they decided to work on health promotion in people with severe social problems. They had put in contact with the Ministry of Health, cover to, so they established an island, was established with the polyclinics of these names that are in this neighborhood. Next. The activities that are being carried out as blood pressure measurement, glucose and cholesterol determinations, they are carrying out health promotion in coordination with physicians. And pharmacies and physicians has an agreement of carrying out the same activity with the same language, with the same purpose to these populations. Different indicators of quality assurance are being tested because how does satisfaction, satisfaction index could be measured in this area where people is not fully aware of what should be done and where basic, very basic necessities are not completely covered. But for us, it was a very important initiative because it could show that even where money is not available, important things can be carried out. Finally, just a third example of the group of nine that were selected to be presented in this national meeting on the 9th of November, Medicines at Home, that was carried out by this pharmacy. 